Straight talk with Dr. Chance. Talk a little bit about R. Kelly. Not a whole lot. But um, as everybody knows, he's uh, the new racketeer. Racketeer is really something that comes from back to uh, Al Capone. That was what it was designed for. They had to come up with something uh, that they could really accuse him for. It's very difficult to accuse him for a molestation because these young girls were not that young. When you're in your teens, it's kind of hard to do that. Consent in most states is 16 years old. Doesn't mean that Kelly did, R. Kelly didn't have a problem. He's, he's relatively old. Uh, and he shouldn't do better, but the truth is, you do silly things when you got a lot of power and a lot of money because people throw themselves at you and you take advantage of people. You can take advantage of people without having power and money, but power and money makes you that much more powerful, that much more influence on people. Uh, we see that just by looking at society in its whole. So I don't think um, uh, he's, uh, what they have accused him for, I think he is guilty of abusing and misusing young people, young girls, you know. So, you know, but people take things and they do things, they blow things out of, out of proportion and they do what they want to do to bring down certain people uh, to show uh, certain things that they can do these things for the most part. But uh, the bottom line is... Uh, he wasn't sex trafficking as we really know it to be because that's kidnapping somebody, really kidnapping somebody and uh, taking them off and abusing them. Uh, these girls weren't kidnapped. They were really given to him by the parents and allowed to be under his custody by the parents. Everybody needs to go down if that's the fact. But R. Kelly has some problems. He has some sexual spirits. I always end things up with the God aspect of it. He has a sexual, spiritual problem and he can't get over that. You need deliverance to get over that. And that's what led him to his downfall. And most of us don't have to take a downfall behind having these kind of problems. Some people have them and they don't take a downfall. But sometimes when you're in the limelight, you know, and things blow up, on you and you take so much advantage of your authority and your power and your your money and your fame uh you end up in this situation that's all i got to say about that hey y'all uh tune into the next video uh dr chess and hey y'all stay blessed